All right, I seen one. Where did it go? I mean, we got how to borrow a way to real estate. Yeah, there it was. There you go. How to borrow your way to real estate riches by Tyler G. Hicks. Let's see what year this was. Night, well, 1979. So this is, look at this. This is your, your first, um, uh, man, I can't even think about how to do it. So these are, this is your first kind of like guru from back in the day. Uh, let's see. Wait a minute. There's no way, dude. 1921. There's, are you kidding me? This is, yeah, see, 1987. Where do you get the 19? Oh, that's probably when he was born. Anyway. Look at this. It tells you you can pick your your income level. You can a thousand dollars a year. It's five hundred. You get to pick your level, uh, you want, and using the method it gives you in the book. So we can do a houses, apartments, blah 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 blah. blah. So he's basically telling you he's in it so you can get to one million dollars back in 87. Wow. Look at this list. So he, he basically goes through all this. Okay. Where is table of contents? Wow. He, he, that's a whole bunch. Uh, how borrow money can make you rich in real estate. Earn real estate millions using other people's money. Put zero cash uh, success methods to work for you. Mortgage out uh, to build a bill of real estate. Sir steps to getting real estate. Make your borrowed money automatic a fortune fast. Uh, let's try. Let's let's look at what he's talking about. No, yeah, let's look at this. Fifty seven. Put zero money. Zero money, man. Let's see it. Let's see what he's talking about. Put zero cash, real estate, success, methods to work for yourself. Okay. Although every one of the thousands of BWBs I've met needs, what is a BWB, I wonder? Uh, the kind of help these folks need is a five-page word money. This is... Okay, this is mostly just... Probably the most direct way to get started on zero cash is to borrow the money you need to buy a piece of income property. You can borrow the money in a number of ways. Signature loan, collateral loan, on purchase, mortgage loan. On a loan, uh, blah, 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 blah. Use a signature loan to start. Yeah, what? Okay. A signature loan is a loan that you, you get based on signing a note in which you promise to repay the lender. You do not put up any collateral to get the signature loan. The usual loan is based on, okay, whatever. I do borrow as much as 20, other states maximum of 10,000. And there are mail order lenders who lend you as much as 25 grand. If you get a free list of mail order lenders from the editors. Of, okay, look. We can, I wonder, we'll have, we'll have to check and see if they're still there. Wow. That would be completely crazy if these people are still in business. Now, obviously, they got probably an internet website now. Improve your signature loan. Okay, so it's basically just telling you, okay, typical loan scoring system. Uh, more than 10 years, 25 points, weekly income. Wow, that's really low. This is really old. Credit rating, property ownership, owns little cash value in property. So, yeah, I mean, I'll, let, I'll hold it right here so you can kind of read.
Uh, okay, raise money faster. I want to thank you for a good, your good book, Bottle Bar, and great finance, the concept of offering a finance fee, including the good. I raised fifty thousand for a corporate loan by offering a potential investor a finance fee that included a consignment fee. Just as you suggested, the potential in investor became intrigued with finding the money, and ended up being the consignment co-signer as well as the finance. Okay, look at that. What is that right here? And a date of 2020 mail order letters. Wow. And 800 numbers. Wow. Okay, so yeah, this is... Uh, he, he guys a lot of different ways. This is going to be interesting. Here you go. Put it... He's as simple as advertising and, and looking out for a, a loan. Or like a co-signer. or something to go with you. Get credit card loans. Make rent. Errors work for you? What is that? And we took our second home and producing income producing building. There was a rent other errors. Account of eleven thousand. We had a clause inserted in the purchase contract that stated that we that any rent or errors we could collect would belong belong to us instead of the seller. As soon as we took over the building, I started working on collecting back rents. Just four weeks, I collected five hundred thousand or five fifty five hundred. So our down payment of seven nine was reduced to two thousand. Since most buildings have rent errors of some amount when they are sold, this amount is very useful for reducing. Look, that was I. I didn't even know. I didn't even know what the word meant. But look at it like that. That's another way to make money, right? That's gonna be an interesting one for everybody. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get a lot of people interested in real estate. Everybody loves real estate. All right. I'm hungry. I'm going to get something to eat. Talk to y'all later on.